everyone. Uh, we're in year two, but not for long. We're about to move from Key Stage 1 to Key Stage 2. Key Stage 1 is year 1 and 2. Key Stage 2 is year 3, year 4, year 5, and year 6. What do you mean? I was just talking about we're about to move from Key Stage 1 to Key Stage 2. Is there a Key Stage 3? Of course, but don't worry about that. We're going to do that later. Okay. What are you talking about? We're talking about, about we're talking about key stage one and key stage two. But we're in year two. Oh, <sighs> sit down and let's do some explaining. We love it here at the infant school. There's so much to do. We're curious, kind. Generous and independent. Delightful. Fun. Fun. <laughs> and not forgetting confident, successful, responsible. We've worked so hard with other teachers and we have so many memories. I don't know. Let's ask them. Let me think. Oh, I remember bonfire night. You all came and even though it was at night time, we had lots of fun and we played lots of games and the fireworks were amazing. That's what I remember. And now, my favorite in year two was swimming gala. I was so surprised to see how the little children jump in the big pool and start swimming like a fish. It was really wonderful. Oh, what I like most this year is seeing you all improving in reading. I like that most. My favorite memory of year two was definitely the heart of Tafiti. I was so proud of how you guys sang and danced your hearts out. And the best part was that song where you guys had all the material and you were shaking it because you guys were the ocean. That was my favorite memory of year two. Mwah. Hold on, if it's so great, then why are we leaving? The sum of the petal. We always reach for the highest. What? The sum of the petal, the school motto. Uh oh, I knew that. When we are in year three, we still have special ed lessons. I remember what they are. Fellow year twos, pauses for you and quiz your parents. Do they know? So, yes, specialist lessons carry on in year three. And you'll be getting to use specialist classrooms a bit more often as you'll be right there in the center of the action. For athletics and football. The top field for volleyball, hockey, and netball. The swimming pool, the swimming pool, the amphitheater, the music room, the learning lab, and whilst we are all relaxing over the holidays, the language rooms, art room, drama space, and food room will be completed. You can add to that flexible learning. Flexible learning runs through three o'clock to four o'clock every day. We don't know what we'll do next year. Let's look at this year. Fire, hmm. Cooking, circus skills, wow. My plans for arrangement might have to change when I go to Kisonga. I might have to wake up earlier and and last Friday I saw people walking to school, tricycling to school and driving in private cars in school and some people in the Raven bus.
confident, responsible, successful. Does that look different in year three? Let's ask. As you move into year three and join Key Stage 2, there is a greater expectation on personal responsibility. To help you out, we've compiled a few things that both the teachers and students in year three and four think you should be able to do. We think you should be able to tie your own shoelaces. You should be able to pack your own bags on the way to school. And I think you should be ready now to ask for help when you need to. I'm sure there are lots of things on here that you can already do, but let's find out a little bit more. Part of the Student Council, we are inviting you when you get to Year 3 to get involved. This year we have put, we have put together some outdoor learning resources and have supported the Bandari Project in Toronto. We still work eat, play, and go home, but with a few differences. School starts at 8 a.m. and finishes at 3 p.m. Unless you have flexible learning, which goes on till 4 p.m. Break time is from 9.40 to 10 o'clock, and lunch time is from 12.30 to 1.30. We have two nurse friends, Nurse Florence, who ranges between both sites, and Nurse Grace, who is in Kasongo full-time. If I am feeling unwell, I will let my teacher know and I will be escorted to a nurse's office where I will be treated. If I am unable to be treated, I, I, my parents will be called and I will be taken to a doctor's office for, for more care. Hello everyone, my name is Anita Ugasa and I am the primary office. I'm in charge of all the telephones and emails traffic. Although you're there and I'm here, we always remain in constant communication. So please make sure that you help us help you. And do you know what makes me very happy? Up to date contact details. Okay. You will continue to read with purpose and pleasure, but we will stretch your thinking a little bit more because you are getting bigger and you can take it. We will try to manage these tasks outside of the school. Your topics will be different too, but you will be building on all the things you've learned in Key Stage 1. Jerusalem, <laughs> Ikayalami, Ilondoloze, Uhambenami, Zumangishilana, Jerusalem, Ikayalami, Yeah. 